There was a point at which your sister was given the diagnosis of borderline. Mm -hmm. Do you remember anything about about learning about that diagnosis or that time? I do. Um, yeah, so my sister was on a very long journey to kind of put her life back together and to figure out what's going on, why are these kind of constant challenges being thrown at her, why is the world so damn hard to navigate? And so she was the one who checked herself into McLean to try to figure out what's happening. And so I remember the day when my dad came and said, well, you know, they've given her this diagnosis of borderline personality disorder. And none of us knew what that was, and none of us had any sort of preconceived notions. You know, people had given her different diagnoses, bipolar disorder, and so it was kind of like, there was no stigma. We weren't like, oh no, it's borderline. Oh my God, she's got this borderline. There was none of that. It was just kind of, oh, okay, some of this, some of this clearly fits who she is. Some of it doesn't. So, oh, is this definitely the right diagnosis? Um, I, I can't even say there was relief because there had been diagnoses proffered before. And I'm not sure I have always faith in diagnoses or sort of, okay, this person's snapped with this and now we know what's going on, so all's gonna be well. I think it was kind of, all right, well, this is interesting. Now, will she be given the help she needs because of this diagnosis?